Okay students, now we are going to proceed with section B, Severability Essay. Severability is a measure of the proportion of life, healthy cell within a population. Severability Essay are used to determine the overall health of cell and the cell survival following the treatment. Now we are going to investigate the cell capability on surviving if the hydrogen peroxide is added in the living cell at different concentration. So now we are going to observe the cell ability over the hydrogen peroxide treatment. Okay class, this is the real biosafety uh, cabinet. Okay. Okay class, uh, this is the real of flask that consists of cells. Okay. Inside this flask is the cell. In this section B, we are going to use the cell culture. Hydrogen peroxide in different series of concentration. That here this is a 250 micromolar. This is uh, 200. This is uh, 150 and etc. We also need the 96 well uh, for cell culture and also the pipettes. Hydrogen peroxide is a byproduct of respiration in the living cell. Hydrogen peroxide is harmful and must be removed as soon as it is produced in the cells. Enzyme catalyst is useful to remove this hydrogen peroxide. Well, MPS is used to assess the cell proliferation, cell ability, and also cell toxicity. In this treatment, we are going to observe the cell ability after the hydrogen peroxide treatment at 250, 200, 150, 125, 175, 50, and 25 micromolar of hydrogen peroxide. And the control cell is the cell that are not being treated with any of the hydrogen peroxide. First, we need to label the 96 well with the different concentration of the hydrogen peroxide that we are going to use. Like here, I already label the, the concentration that I'm going to use. Here, I already label the concentration of the hydrogen peroxide that I'm going to use. Then, I also put B as a blank, which is a uh, media without any of the cells. We need the cell that has been harvested from the T flask cell culture. This is the cell culture that I have uh, harvested from the T flask. So now I'm going to put the cells in a quadruplicate. Means that in four well. Please put the cell for each of the concentration of hydrogen peroxide that we are going to use. Okay, for the blank, I will put the media only without the cell culture okay, this is media the well ok now we need to put uh, this uh, cell culture or this well in the cell culture incubator so let the cell culture to be sediment for 24 hours so now I will put in the cell culture incubator ok 
class, I already prepare for you the cell culture that has been sediment in the cell culture incubator for 24 hours. So I'm going to use it now. So now we are going to treat our cell culture with the hydrogen peroxide. So first of all, you must prepare your concentration of the hydrogen peroxide. Okay, based on the lab manual, please check the concentration that we need. Like here, we need 250 micromolar of the hydrogen peroxide. So this is the lowest concentration here is the 25 micromolar. So I will start with the lowest one. Now I will start with the 25 micromolar. So check back at your levels. Okay. So now I'm going to put one drop of the hydrogen peroxide, 25 micromolar, at the well that I already label with the 25 micromolar. So at this row, I have to put all the cell with the 25 micromolar of the hydrogen peroxide. This is also include the blank. So for the cell control, you don't have to put any of the hydrogen peroxide. So I'm going to put it now. done okay now i go to the higher uh, concentration of the hydrogen peroxide which is 50 now i put at the i look at the level so i put it now 50 done now i take another concentration of hydrogen peroxide okay. please do the same thing to all of the concentration and be careful don't mismatch uh, your label and also your hydrogen peroxide now after you do that you have to incubate once again your cell culture with the treated uh, hydrogen peroxide in the uh, cell culture incubator for another uh, 12 to 24 hours to see the direction of the cell viability. Okay, class, I also prepared to you the cell culture that have been treated with the different concentration of hydrogen peroxide for 24 hours so we take that plate okay now we want to check the activity of the solvability so I will take the MTS so we need to put all the well with the one drop of the MTS done close back the well and then put the well in the incubator after putting the treated cell culture with the MTS we need to incubate uh, this uh, treated cell culture in the incubator for three to four hours so we will let the reaction to happen and then next we can observe what happened to your survivability AC okay let's check it out <laughs> 